the bar one handicap chase is next in uh, this is a two mile handicap 0 to 130 again and the top one is five points for darren thompson night star ryan costello brushstrokes paul rhodes coco bell john morgan ecleal tech and bees for lunda for james shane mao picker daniel french what mavro david robertson chiller melbourne graham clutterbuck one master david hooley admiral ascoli martin leader and herbalistic rumpus for ryan costello so 12 then this time facing the starter and called in and away they go and he's going to be the first one to show plenty of greys in this but look at five i think all together that's something we don't see too often five greys in a figure of 12 and it's coco bell who is the leader by about a length as they come past the winning post then with a whole circuit to go Coco Bell's in front from Brushstrokes in second, then the first the Grays, what Mavro is third, the second one, Nightstar is fourth. They get to the first of the ten, which they're all safely over. We've got three Grays at the back as well. Admiral Ascoli, Herbalistic not Herbalistic Rumbus, Chiller Melbourne, and um, one master, the one on the outside is Herbalistic Rumpus. The angle made that look as though it was last, but it wasn't, as they get over number two. And they're all safely over the second as well, then, with another one of these John Morgan front runners. Heartbreak for his front runner in the last race, wasn't it? Led for about three and three quarter miles and then got collared in the last couple of furlongs but this one he'll be hoping it stays in front but it will not stay in front if it jumps like that because it runs straight into that fence and it's allowed brush strokes to take it up so brush strokes and has gone on but coco bell is ready to fight back as they come to this ditch and jump that one much better got over it nicely and has regained the lead so coco bell's in front again in there herbalistic rumpus was a faller at the back but it's coco bell in front from brush strokes in second then comes what mavro and night star then Mao Picker and um, five points. At one of Scully's after that one, then Ecclil Tech. Then comes Chiller Melbourne, Bees Fallander, and finally one master on the outside. So, as you'd expect, they're going lickety split as they come down to this next one. This is the fifth of the ten, and the leader jumped it really well again. The one that made the mistake this time was Watt Mavro, but it's Coco Bell and Brushstrokes clear. From in third place, Night Star. Then five points. Admiral Ascoli is next. Then what Mavro recovering for that mistake. A Cleal Tech is being pushed along a little bit. Grand Clutterbox horse is trying to make a bit of ground as well. A mistake there. This time by Night Star. Stable companion Herbalistic Rumpus already out of the race. Trying to go for a double there. Ryan Costello, a double of fallers as they take that next one. Coco Bell jumped it slowly. And Brushstrokes has gone back into the lead again. So Brushstrokes is in the lead on the inside from Coco Bell on the outside second. Night Star is now going well again in third. Then what Mavro and Mao Picker, and after that one, Ecclil Tech, Admiral Ascoli is next, and then Bees Fall Under, five points, one master, and finally Chiller Melbourne, but a race is on in earnest with five furlongs to go, and it's Coco Bell in the lead, then Coco Bell over to third last, gets away from it nicely, in second place, Brush Strokes, then comes Nightstar, Mao Picker, Ecclil Tech, Watt Mavro, they're all coming down with chances now, five points, is trying to run on a bit, so too is one master on the outside, and Admiral Ascoli trying to get into it over the second last, that's the final ditch, they're over that one nicely, and it's Coco Bell in the lead, but look at this one master, on the outside and also Night Star. So Night Star it is that takes it up then. So Night Star's in front from Coco Bell. Brush strokes and then five points. One master's dropped away just as quickly as he started to get into it. But it's Night Star with one to jump. Night Star in the lead. Five points in second. It looks like Night Star's got him thinking about this. Night Star the grey then coming down towards the final fence with a clear lead. But here comes Brush Strokes and a clear tech. And over that one they go. Oh a mistake there by Brush strokes and now all of a sudden it's Night Star being challenged by Ecclil Tech and here comes Coco Bell fighting back again. Coco Bell's got back into lead now. Brush strokes is fighting back. It's Coco Bell and Brush strokes. Coco Bell on the outside. Brush strokes on the near side. Then race the one side and Brush strokes has got up to take it on the line. Coco Bell was second and then five points. And goodness me, what a race that was. Coco Bell and brush strokes both looked beaten and came back and fought out a ding dong battle in that final half furlong and um, brush strokes takes it sh shades of so6 season five or six all over again as morgan and rose battled out up the straight and it's brush strokes for paul rose the winner coco bell for john morgan second five points darren thompson was third Ecclil Tech for James Shea was fourth and night star for Ryan Costello looked all over the winner jump in the last ended up fifth